So as you all know, um, we have we now have a semester program. This was our first year having the semester program. So in the fall, we had 12 students that were on the semester and left sadly on the 17th of December. And then um, we were very excited though, of course, to welcome our new group of semester students that are here for the second semester. We have 11 students that are here for the second semester. Um, I, I mean, the biggest obvious difference is time. <laughs> um, it's a very, there's a huge difference between being here for a semester and being here for a full year. Um, the first semester goes by very fast as does the second semester, but the first semester is on the calendar shorter. Um, and there's a lot of transitioning. There's a lot of getting used to using Spanish, getting used to your family, all of those things that happen in the fall. And we do see our full year students when they get back, kind of it's like, ah, uh, kind of like, it's like they're coming back home. There's none of that nervousness that they had at the beginning. But I don't know. I think Elenia, I mean, Elenia and Ashton, I mean, I also have been in touch with our first semester students, but it, could you two both talk a little bit about what you've heard from them, the students that left? Ashton, do you want to take this one? Yeah, sure. Um, I happen to be here or in the beginning of the first semester, I happened to be here at SY Spain with three other students from my sending school. Um, three of us, including myself, are full year students, and one of them was a semester student. Um, and, you know, I've kept in touch with the semester student because even before coming to SYA, we were really good friends. And, you know, we've been texting really recently since, you know, we're still in that transition period from first semester to second semester, and she's getting settled back, settled in back at home. Um, and, you know, she has expressed to me that even though like, you know, she wanted to go back home and see her family and kind of just like feel at home, she kind of, she kind of feels like she's left another home behind. And I feel like that says a lot about one, the experience and relationships you create here at SY Spain, but also just, you know, that I, she's told me that if she could have stayed, she definitely would have. And, you know, hearing that, um, especially as we approach the end of the first semester, I was kind of expected because you know, I, I love it here in Spain and I was really sad that my friend was leaving but couldn't Im imagine myself leaving. Um, but it's a really interesting decision to make because I know when I was thinking about doing SYA, the kind of semester versus full year was something that I had up in my head and I wasn't really sure. Um, e and even in the moment when I stepped on the plane, I was like, am I really going to Spain for a full year? But something deep in me told me that, you know, I just had to just go for it, jump into it. And I'm glad that I made the decision that I did because, you know, um, the first semester I felt like for me is when I was able to just get settled in and acquainted with living in Spain. And now is when I know I'm gonna be able to make my most growth, not only as a Spanish speaker, but as an individual and a person. And I'm just looking forward to what the rest of the year will bring. Yeah, I just wanna, oh, Elena, you go real quick. And then I do wanna say one quick thing about the semester program. All right, um, just to add on to what Ashton said, for me, the first semester felt like almost the dress rehearsal to the second semester. Um, I felt for the most, I didn't feel like I was fully part of the city yet, part of the community here in Saragossa. I felt like I was still learning it, um, that I was still almost like a tourist the entire time, kind of observing the city and appreciating it, but not truly living here. And then coming back from, from the vacation that I took with my parents, um, it felt, it did feel like coming back home. Like I, I felt like I was coming back to my bed, to my house, to my family. I was excited to go back to my school, to go back to my favorite restaurants that I knew and where people knew me. And so I feel like now I'm actually living here in Spain as a local instead of just as a tourist. Um, so I do feel like having the second semester to really live feeling grounded here in the city is super important. Yeah, I just want to quickly just say that there is not an option for students to extend. Um, we had multiple first semester students make kind of official pleas to be able to, to stay for the second semester, but because of well, mostly because we have another group of students coming in for the second semester. Our school space is quite small. We cannot handle having 75 students, um, but also the visa process, um, the visas end at the holiday, so that's not easy to extend. And some of our host families for second semester students 
we're also host families for first semester students. So um, it is it is a really important thing to think about because it's once that decision's made, it's not something that can be changed. 